Hello there everyone, Xantok here with Select Star Gaming and welcome back to more Persona 4 Golden. How's it going there, Curb? It's going alright. It sounds like we got some free time while our friend is stuck in the castle, so that's a thing. Yeah, yeah, uh, we're supposed to save them super urgently, but um... Uh, we're... Nah, we'll get to them eventually. They can, they, uh -oh. that, that's fine. They're fine until, you know, the fog happens. And that they won't be happening for a while. It'll be okay. Hmm. However, there is something about uh, the top of this episode. So, I've gone over before how there's different social stats, you know, courage, knowledge, and all that. Oh, wow. Okay, game. Yes, I can do things at night. Uh, if I have mm -hmm. part-time jobs, I can do those. I can read. I can study. I can do work at my table if I have anything to work on the table for. The calendar... Yeah, let's go ahead and take a look at the calendar. Fuck it, why not? Nothing's on the calendar. Except no. show a day, which... I don't know what that is. Are we sure that's not like a fog day or something? Or no, is that not what it means? No, I think it's like a Japanese holiday. That, that Coincidentally, though, that is the last day that we can save Yukiko. But I don't think the game would just tell you that. Because we also got Constitution Day, Children's Day, all these... Ugh, midterms. Oh, the worst test results. You know, it just shows you like whenever there's special things happening, school camp out. He's just starting to get a little spoilery. So let's not go through those. But anybody that has played other games in the series, or at least one in particular, might recognize that this calendar says Persona Three on it, and has art from that game. So that's it does. Funny. Oh, that's funny. Yep. Okay, so what I was mentioning, um, you know, you, I've told you before about you can go to sleep and get some random points from your friends. There's things you can do at your work table, read books, and you can study. When you study, you obviously would get knowledge. Sometimes you'll get one knowledge up, sometimes you'll get two knowledge ups. There are going to be some days in this game where the guy tells you save abuse until you get two knowledge ups, and we hope the RNG is going to be kind to us. Oh. Yeah. Let's... So you have to just keep trying this until we get... Uh-huh. Oh, we have to study until we get plus two yep because if we don't get it then we're going to be off schedule and it can be a tight schedule because sometimes you need uh certain amounts of knowledge in order to even do other things or talk to certain people get get their social no words get their social rank up or social link ranks up to certain points um like i know i don't know if there's any that uh require knowledge for social links but jobs can mm -hmm. as well and i know there are some social links where in order to get them actually to the end you get to max out expression so, you gotta do this shit. Alright. Let's hope we get it. You decide to study. Knowledge. Ah. Uh, it would it say it begins. twice or something? Yeah, it would have said it twice. Okay. Which means... You say it beforehand, at least. We ignore everything that's happening here. We pretend that we don't see that. Mm-hmm. And then it, we reload. We, oh, we have to... Oh. Oh, yeah. We gotta. This is gonna take a bit. Okay. Oh, I wish they had these scheduled on days when it wasn't gonna help you a whole bunch of stuff that I had to fast Click forward through. to every time. But you know, it's it's a thing. We might be. We might have to see those two guys welcome to school for a few times. What really sucks is this isn't gonna be the only CBBs for two of knowledge ups we're doing in today's episode. Yeah. Oh, gonna... oh it's the it's the knowledge episode. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. This. Thank you, game. Oh my god. Good god. If this gets- if it happens- if we get too many failures, I'm just gonna cut through and just skip to the end. But Fair I'm enough. hoping we won't have to do that. Fuck. Same thing. Yup. Mm. Kinda wish there was a soft reset. There is not. Makes sense. Yeah, at least it's not making me go through, like, plot that I have to skip through, or the school asking me questions. So there's that, Oh, at least. gosh. However, that the next time point. will. The next time will. Oh, dear. Yeah. Okay. Oh, my God, game. Look at that, though. 22,000 money. <laughs> so I could try to get the, a question wrong just to be funny. Yes. Mm-hmm. Let's try this again. 
Oh my god. Come on, game. Please give me that second knowledge up. I actually legitimately do need it. Oh my god. Mm. We'll keep trying. Yep. I mean, we have to. This is one of my biggest annoyances. Less so about this guide and more so about how there's the time crunch of doing everything. I technically could um, go with just the one, but it means I will be going completely off script and I'll have to be like trying to refigure things out as I play through and I really don't want to have to do that if I if absolutely possible. I know there's one area where I might have to do that with no choice anyways. And if okay. that's the case, I mean, oh well, whatever, I have to do it. But where I can, I need to follow the guide. Right, that makes sense. Yeah. You do know this better, so. Like, this is annoying, but at least it's something easy. Fair enough. Ah! <clears throat> God. I'm going to be really worried if it's like, it just says it increases, but it doesn't actually specify how much. No, it, it would say up there, your knowledge has increased twice. It would do that. It would actually call it twice. Okay, good. Yeah. yeah. Otherwise, there would be no I way to know. I was concerned. Did. Yeah, like, the, otherwise, there'd be no way to know that um, you had gotten it twice because it doesn't show you any kind of point value or anything. The, the um, closest you can get to seeing a point value, if it's like one, two, or three music notes, like uh, when I'm talking to Yosuke or whatever, mm -hmm. for uh, getting points to his arcana. Yes. But, uh,. Even then, that's not. That doesn't mean one, two, or three points. Fair enough. Yeah, it's a complicated thing. Mm -hmm. So, what you want to talk about? Uh, well, not the weather, cause it's shit. Yeah. Oh, you meant in real life, not the game. Oh no, I meant in the game. No. Oh. <laughs> okay. Knowledge. Nope. Oh my god. No. How many before before we cut? Ten minutes. Ten more. Ten minutes. Okay. Not not more minutes, but the ten minute mark. Yes. Okay. Hmm. You know oh we gosh. know we're gonna, we're we're gonna get away from this later anyway. Yep. Like, we'll properly read through that later, because they're talking about how, like, oh, yeah, there's sports clubs that you can join. You should join a sports club. Mm -hmm. It's like, yeah, I know. We'll, we'll get there. Trust me, game. We'll, <laughs> we'll get there. Just let me do some time traveling. Sports clubs? That sounds like another dungeon to me. Am I right? Oh. No, that was intentional. I'll try to see if maybe I can trick it. Trick also, it? Also, uh -oh. now I can save, and I don't have to deal with that health notification again. Huh. <gasps> Good, good, good point. I, I don't know if it'll actually do anything, but I know in some games, like depending what the RNG is, you can manipulate it a little bit, do something slightly different, and the numbers will keep recalculate. I don't know if that works here, but I'm just trying it. I get it. Hmm. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. What a great game! I mean, it is, but fuck. Thank God this is fast forward. Boy, I wonder if those characters with unique models are important at all. Huh. Oh, wow. What they an were? idea. Well, oh they my didn't. Gosh. Well, one had blue hair. And that's different. Mm. And then one of them had, like, an open jacket and not the oh uniform. My. So, I mean, they might be. Unique characters. Maybe. I don't know. Knows. Maybe. Mm -hmm. Manipulation. Manipulation. <laughs> I was rotating it too fast. The model couldn't handle it. What part in the room do we do the Konami code to get this to work? Oh, oh you are tricking it. I just did the Konami code. I popped oh. down the AV start. Oh my gosh. <laughs> It's going to be my shit. fault if it doesn't work this time, though. Yes! Oh my god! As you studied, you read a number of dictionary entries that piqued your interest. Your knowledge has increased the second time. 
Oh. oh. We have to do Konami code every time now. Oh my god. That was also the last one at the 10 minute mark. Yes. I did a thing. Hello. Hello, Margaret. I knew you were calling. Strange, isn't it? I realize this is sudden, but I'm Margaret. We met at the Velvet Room the other day. There's I'm suddenly Margaret. <laughs> I forgot to warn you about. So I thought it best to contact you immediately. Going to save your friends is a selfless and noble deed. By all means, we encourage and support you in regards to this matter. But to proceed too hastily in that quest will mean facing one battle after the next. Though uh, you may be pressed for time, devoting yourself to battles will not quench your heart's yearnings. The bonds created through social links are another important means of strengthening the powers of your persona. Do not hasten heedlessly through your days. And remember the importance of moving at a sustainable pace. Please remember that. Well then, if you'll excuse me. So basically what she's saying there is, hey, you can go save your friend now, but we want you to both not rush into that because you can make yourself stronger in other ways. Like if I spend more time with Yosuke, I can give him some abilities. But mm -hmm. also, don't take too long or they'll die. Exactly. It's all about pacing. Yeah. Because like we were joking about in the beginning, like, oh, she's in a castle. Well, we got a week. But yep. that makes like it. That's the game telling you, which is, I think, a really good one. Mm -hmm. And you also don't have to do the dungeons all in one day. Like if you're having, if you're struggling with it, you can go through like maybe the first, let's say, the th first three or four floors, and then you can leave and then come back another day when you are uh, fully refreshed on your health and such. Mm hmm. I get what you're saying. We, however, will be doing everything in one day. It's fine. It's fine. All right, so do you want a blue boy or brown boy? I mean, they're hair colors. Oh my gosh. They are, oh my God, they are unique. Shoot. Um, I'll be male suit in a sweatsuit. <laughs> All right, then you're this guy. I'm brown boy. Yes, brown hair. Yo. Oh, what's up? You got morning practice? You can hear the two talking. Mm-hmm. You know how guys that kind of joined the sports club t starting today, right? I thought that maybe if I ran around a little, that would be some good promotion. Dude, if you run around in that, how are people going to know which club you're in? I didn't think about that. <laughs> oh, that's classic you. I hope our club gets some fresh blood too. It gets everyone excited. Uh, Blood is at the vampire. He's the vampire clip. Oh, great. Twilight. Uh, <laughs> never. Never, I know. Are you guys not gonna try and get some people to sign up? I don't know about that. Everyone say they want a girl to be our manager, though. Uh -oh. oh, hey, let's stop by the shrine of the shopping district on our way home today. Might as well pray for some newcomers. We're leaving it that up to God now? But all right. Oh yeah, did you hear that rumor about that thing that lives at the shrine? I did. I wonder if it's true. <laughs> a thing living at the shrine. I wonder if we'll look at that someday. Well, I have a feeling they will. Oh, totally. The fog will mm -hmm. come after several days of rain. Again, your daily reminder about this. You must prepare to take action. You're cool being told that you can join a sports club. Maybe you can find out how to join one by visiting the faculty office on the first floor of the classroom building. Oh. Were we told, or...? Well, there's a teacher. We eavesdrop. <laughs> I'm assuming there was probably a teacher that also mentioned during the school day. So, there are two different sports clubs that we can join, and we are going to go find out a little bit about them. Gotcha, okay. Because I know what the choice I need to make in the guide is, and it's also... Probably, it's the choice I would make in reality. But I'm curious what your choice would be. That's the office. Mm. All right, let's go ask about clubs. Oh, it's you. Eh, you want to join a club? Oh, no. I know what you're really after. You're just trolling for girls, aren't you? Admit it. What? Oh, Listen boy. up. A club is supposed to be... For some reason, you find yourself giving lectures, and I can't imagine why. So, 
still want to join a club. We're not about sports clubs. Oh, okay. Trying to break a youthful sweat, are you? You can join either the that soccer club bad. or the basketball club. After leaving the faculty office, make a left and go through the other exit down the hall to get where the sports clubs meet. By the way, club days are Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. Sports clubs don't meet on rating days. Got it? So are we done here? Yeah, for now we are. We'll learn about these other options later. Okay. Go home already. Are you staying at school to hang out with a girl later on or something? Well, I have better odds than you. I mean, those teeth. Oof. Mm-hmm. All right, so... It already made us turn left when we exited the door. We're just gonna go down this hall. Okay. All right, so... Yes, Igor, tell me about social links again. We've done this before. So we can go ahead and take a tour first of both the clubs. That way we don't have to make Ooh, our okay. choice yet. Nice. You also got me high gym. You watch the basketball team. Nice shot. All right, let's run some basic drills. And the high f and the field. You watch the soccer team. That's you. Yeah, nice kick. All right, line up. It's time for everyone's favorite. Sprints. Is it? No. It is not everyone's favorite. So, mm -hmm. now if you were playing this game, which club would you choose? Basketball or soccer? I would join soccer, actually. That's the one I would want to join. Well, that but is... Oh, no, go on. I was about to say, like, you're about to tell me if I was correct or not by our, our guide. Well, I mean... Technically speaking, when you're playing this game, you can choose whichever one you want. The reason why the guide has us choose one over the other is because it's a certain book that you get sooner uh, while joining the soccer club than you would get if you joined the basketball club. Oh, so, so you want to join it sooner. Right. Well, not joining the club sooner, but you get that book sooner. Less interactions right. to get it. Uh, when I did my second playthrough, I chose the basketball club just to see what it was like. And I actually prefer the story of the basketball club. Okay. Yeah, so there's that. Which is a bummer, so we have to just join soccer for yeah. the book, but yeah. I think it's still fine, though. Alright, guys, listen up. You have a new teammate. You all know Ryuga Kiwanji, right? He's from the city, so I'm sure he's got some moves he's just waiting to show off. Sir, sir, it's Ryoga, sir. Not Ryuga, it's Ryoga. I'm sure to remember sir. that, Mr. Kid. Mr. Kid? <laughs> I'd say this season's in the bag. I'm even thinking about making him captain. Wait, what? You can hear the other players whispering, and some jealous looks thrown your way. Maybe. Hmm. The, the city. city, huh? No, yeah, oh. take it. No, that's the same voice I was I've about been to a few, do. Yeah. <laughs> no, I bet he plays for some big team back home. <laughs> Look at him, city slicker. Probably thinks he's better than us. Yeah, we're just yeah, we're just a bunch of hicks to him. Here, why don't you say something to the team? Uh oh. Um. <laughs> You're not saying anything. Okay. Nice to meet you. <laughs> yeah. They don't seem very friendly. Me. All right. Let's start with a few laps. Ryoga, why don't you just watch for today? Practices <laughs> are on Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays. But we don't practice in the rain. We take the week before exams off, too. So make sure you use that time to study hard, okay? Study hard. Study okay. hard. The other players showing no interest in you. Dispersed about the field. Hey, man. Ooh, boy. Ooh. Don't don't let them get to you. Just play hard and have fun. I'm Daisuke Nagase. Second year, same as you. Nice to meet you. Yo, Daisuke, you waiting for a special invitation? Let's go. Oh hey, you're the transfer student, right? 
Join the soccer team, huh? Hmm. Good. Because they need all the help they can get. Pretty weak team, know what I'm saying? Sh shut up. Your team is just as lame. This big mouth here is Ko. Ko? Ko. 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 Uh, Ko, -Ko. Uh, this is Coco. He's the same grade as us, but he's on the basketball team. Koa Chijo. Ko on the basketball oh. team's up and coming MVP. Okay, Coco. <laughs> Man, get your head out of the clouds. Hey, hey, and that's not all. I'm pretty smart, too. So if you need any help with your test, I'm your man. He's not. Okay. How about a transfer guy? You a smart guy? Stop calling him that. Team's already giving him enough crap as it is. Oh, I can hear it now. Us country folk ain't gonna show up, I know, big shy shit, boy. Gotta love those guys, right? Uh-oh. It's not funny, man. Well, as long as you got some skills, they'll back off sooner or later. You played much soccer before, Ryoga. A little. Hmm. Then, maybe this will take longer than I thought. You became friends with Ko Ichijo of the basketball team and Daisuke Nagase of the soccer team. They accepted you, regardless of the rest of the team's hostility. I feel a faint bond before me between the three of you. Oh. Thou art I, and I am thou. Thou hast established a new bond. It brings thee closer to the truth. Thou shalt be blessed with creating personas of the strength, Arcana. Ooh. And we've established the fellow athlete social link. Hmm. Damn it, now I'm behind on laps. Yogo, wait up for me so we can walk home together. Alright, I'll go get changed. See you in a few. They want to walk right, me home? Cool. Aww. Yeah, oh. you finished watching practice and walked home with Ko and Daisuke. Welcome home! So, yeah. if we had, since we chose soccer, while both Ko and Daisuke will be involved in the link, it's going to primarily focus on Daisuke's story. If we went with basketball, it would focus more on Ko. But both that of them are sense. still involved either way. This is not going to be true whenever we have to choose a cultural club. It will be one or the other. The characters will not mix at all. And that's a good thing. Because one of them sucks. Oh, Backward. no. Yep. You know what else sucks? What? Save scum again? Oh, yeah. We gotta get two more knowledge ups. Oh. Yeah. It's... A thing. Actually, oh, I don't think I can do that right now. I'll have to, there's something I was supposed to do before I went out and talked to them, but I can deal with it tomorrow. Alright. We got one. And we got the yeah. other. Oh, thank goodness. Oh, thank God. That best. Woo! Oh, that's awesome that worked out like that. Yes, it is. Yo! Yo, Ryuga! Hey, I wanted to ask you. You know how we can enter TVs now? As I say this in front of other people that are right, they're going to be truly listening to our conversation. Have you ever of tried course. sticking your hand when the TV is on? What I mean is, have you tried touching the screen while the midnight channel is on? Yes, right? Yeah, we did. We did try it. We don't care. What? That's oh, ahead answer. of the game. No wonder you are later. That's mm -hmm. interesting, though. So you couldn't go to the place that was shown on TV. Which means my idea of jumping directly to wherever you can go is won't work. Oh, he's thinking of like stuff. It, yeah, he is. It seemed like it made so much sense, too. But now that I think about it some more, of course it wouldn't work. Teddy said where you end up depends on which TV you go into. Although, every TV sees the same thing on the Midnight Channel. That seems sort of contradictory. Well, looks like we're gonna suck it up and march straight into that castle. Mm. But we can't really complain. Yukiko-san has it way worse than us. Oh boy. 
very true. I think you can oh, why does he have a puppet? You, this, I this have to be him? Be yours. Yeah, I've, I've already got three of the teachers. Come on. It's man. very true, right? All right. Oh, it's still down now. My house is now in session. My name is Mr. Hosoy. And in this class, you'll be learning about contemporary writing. Let's all have fun. I know this is off topic. But what's the point of applying to co for colleges outside Innova? Why even bother? Nothing good ever comes out of competing with city folk. The countryside is all you need. Definitely oh somebody that never left his town. Or probably his parents' house. Sounds about right. Ain't that right, Mr. Puppet? Well, since this is our very first lesson, why don't you show me how much you already know? Now then, how many parts are there in Murakami's The Wind-Up Bird Chronicle? Huh, John? I'm calling on you. I get the feeling you're not much of a reader. Hey, I read. I mean, not books, but Ryoga. C come on, man. Help me out here. So, how many oh, parts are there? no. I have definitely not heard of what this is before. Two seems like too much of a simple answer, though. The Wind-Up Bird Chronicles. Oh, uh, this is going to be a guess because I've never heard of it before, but I'm going to go seven. But I'm sure we have to get this right, right? We do. It's three. Dang it. Okay. That would have been my second guess, which isn't saying much because it was 50-50 after I eliminated yeah. two. When, when Way Off Trail was going through this portion, and uh, he thought it was seven because, well, they said Chronicles, and three would just be a trilogy. It's like, well, technically Chronicles is just a fancy name for a series. You know, don't... Yeah. Like, they call it the Harry Potter like series, but you could call it the Harry Potter Chronicles if they wanted to. It's but yeah, very it's, true. It's three. I tried. Oh, very Hanachan, either you're more literary than you look, or that was a lucky guess. The Wind Up Bird Chronicle was released as three separate stories. It's the eighth of his twelve published books. His latest book, 1Q84, was published in 2009. Its first printing sold out on the very first day of sale. And, of course, that's not counting all his short stories and essays, which I don't have time to get into right now. Oh, phew. You're a lifesaver, Ryoga. Thanks. Yosuke appreciates us. Damn straight. <laughs> we got points for, Ryo for Yosuke, and oh. our expression went up. We would have gotten less mm -hmm. points if we didn't have Pixie. Oh. Oh my god, it's that warning about the fog. Alright, so before we go do what we need to do today, uh just checking things up real quickly. We actually don't have to do this yet, but I'm gonna go ahead and do it now before I forget. Alright, Yosuke, we'll see you later. Oh actually I do need to need to squall. I forgot about that other part. Yeah, we'll, we'll be able to come back. It's fine. So, we need to go to the shopping district first. Okay. And take a stop at the bookstore. Okay. Oh, Marie, what are you doing here? It looks like she wants to hang out. We're going to be oh. going all through these books. The Lovely Man, Beginner Fishing, and Expert Study Methods. Uh, they'll all have different effects when I read them. Like, Lovely Man will raise my courage. Beginner Fishing will... Uh, Make it easier for whenever I eventually start doing fishing. And extra study We're methods. Fish. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, yes. And uh, mm -hmm. extra study methods, when I finish that, I will gain two, ex uh, two knowledge ups every time. Uh, but then I could get a third random. Oh. Yep. That will be a thing. Uh oh. Hi, Marie. We're actually uh, not going to talk to you just yet. We're going to go to the velvet room. Okay. 
So let's go ahead and check Compendium first. Okay, Margaret, uh, Margaret, I don't need you to explain this. I can do that myself. So you can register personas here. Uh, register data, you can see what they are originally. And current status data is how they currently are because I leveled them up. So I'm going to register Pixie here, so that means I can call Pixie back, and they'll be at the right. same stats and abilities that I last used them. I'm going to do the oh, same awesome. thing with Mizanaki. Uh, if I was Super to... Awesome. Yeah, and I'm going to be fusing Pixie now. Oh, wait a minute. What? Oh, okay, no, I thought that was different. Uh, he's telling me about fusion forecasts here, so I can kind of see effects... Okay, go away, guys. I can read this myself. Thanks. So some days, there will be certain effects that you can do, and they'll get uh, little bonuses. So tomorrow, if I was to fuse the Persona Archangel, they will get mm -hmm. extra stats, and the spell Augie would be added for free. But there's Ooh. nothing for today. When it comes to fusion, I have a few different options. I can fuse three at once. So mm -hmm. like Pixie, Slime, and Angel would create this guy, or a bus. Mm -hmm. Or I can just do two, like Izanagi Slime is Ku Sith. But most of the time I'm gonna be doing a search. Okay. Yes, Igor, thank you. Shut up. I know oh my god. Well actually I don't even know what voice does in this one, that's weird. Uh so this one is, will show me everything that I can make right now, and I can order by Arcana or by level. So, Sinri, I can use Pixie, Izanagi, and Angel. Sandman, I can use Pixie and Angel. Uh, Kusith, Izanagi, and Slime. Really nice stuff. Mm -hmm. We're making a Sandman, because he's strength. Oh, okay. And um, I will get to pick one ability from two Personas I'm fusing to be inherited by Sandman. Uh, I'm not really sure what the calculation is. I'm like, what well, I'm allowed to pass over or not. I, I don't know okay. what determines that. I just know that... It shows one slot there, so I can add one thing, and I'm going to give him Dia, because, hey, healing. Yes. Is this acceptable? Yes, please. Yes. And since I uh -oh. have strength at level 1, he'll get extra experience points. If he was at level 2, he'd get even more experience points. Ooh, okay. Pretty. This is what I needed Pixie and then Angel 4. I sacrificed these two to summon Sandman. Exactly. Oh, oh! I wanted to read that line. <laughs> I want to give him like a, <laughs> a little mischievous coin. <laughs> All right. I don't think he's ever gonna talk again, though. <laughs> nah, he don't. Not unless I fuse a new Sandman, which, well, no. He will be back, Zantonk. <laughs> oh, oh my. Oh, that is weird. Sorry, I take that back. And now, because we'll also need that Pipsy for Yosuke. We have to we'll call her back. Buy her back. Well, it cost the end to bring him back. Do what? Uh, you. I realize it would. Oh it yeah, yeah. You have to buy them back, not just yeah, you summon do. them back. You literally have okay. to pay in. Uh, as you fill out more of your persona compendium, you can get discounts though, so that's pretty nice. Okay. Don't need to save yet. Fair Instead, enough. Said now. Oh, okay, I'll just go back to this menu. We're gonna be going back to the school. Okay. Because we need to hang out with Yosuke today. Ooh, okay. I'm going to hang out in trash cans with him. Yes. Tr trash? There he is. Hey, look, he's trash, but he's my trash. Yo! Yo, Ryuga, you tired? Rushing time is rushing things isn't going to help us, I know. How about we take a little break? All right, since we have Pixie with more points, and we feel our relationship will become closer. Let's spend the afternoon with him. All right. Shopping district, Suzai Daigaku. The famous steak croquettes are tough. Hey, you said it wrong. <laughs> what? You said it wrong. They're steak Fuck. croquettes. You're right. Oh, I will um, never forgive myself. Yeah, you dropped the ball there, but buddy. Well, sticky chunks of steak and croquettes? Man, this really is the country, huh? Well, it is good, though it's tough. She ain't called this stuff tender and juicy. What kind of teeth does she have? Oh, boy. You can hear the women's conversation. Uh-oh. Yes, Yasukami High School, right? His classmate, the Sato-san, went out of business. 
shopping district could disappear. And yet... <laughs> Sorry about that. Yo, you know me. I'm infamous around here. Even his fault. <laughs> yeah. yeah, and we're going to say it must be tough. Because mm -hmm. this is the correct answer. Ooh. No, it's not really. It's me and my parents. I'm not personally involved. Anyway, there's nothing I can do about it. Mm -hmm. I don't think there's anyone in either of us who doesn't know me. At school or around town. Not that I mind, but it sucks that I always gotta mind my manners. Yosuke smiles cheerfully. You feel you understand Yosuke a bit more. Rank 2. Wow, fair nice. The Yosuke Hanamura social link has reached level 2. Your power to create personas of the Magician Arcana has grown. Yosuke's growth of heart has affected his persona as well. As he learns Trafuri. Which is a shitty skill that I hate. Oh no. Your social link what increases as you spend time with the person you have made a social link with. The experience bonus gained when fusing personas increases as the social link of that arcana increases. In addition, yeah. cultivating social links may lead to finding new social links. Find as many social links as you can and increase your social ranks to strengthen your personas. So what that part was saying there is that there are some social links that you have to advance them uh, enough times and then you'll unlock a new social link like the sports one that we started today. Uh, if we do right. that, I think it's... It might be four times? Three or four times, I feel like, uh, we'll unlock uh, a new character that we can make a social link with. Okay, gotcha. Yep. Still, this croquette's damn good, huh? I'm gonna have another. You want one too, right? Okay, let's head home. You eat croquettes with Yosuke until your stomach started to bulge. Then you went home. Oh my. Yeah, I don't really recommend doing that at all. That sounds unhealthy. Going to home? <laughs> well, you know, your stomach Welcome bursting. Home. Right, I get what you're saying. Guess what we're about to do? Save scum? Nope. Oh. We're going to do something that will make it easier. You remember oh, the book. book that you haven't finished yet? Perhaps we should read. And we will. We are going to read Expert the one about Study knowledge. Methods. Yes. Yes. Since it's three chapters, oh, I it will take one... us three times to finish reading it. Ah, uh, I was about to ask. Okay. Yep. You begin reading Expert Study Methods. The book contains tips on how to concentrate during class and take notes effectively in order to increase knowledge retention. Though, while reading it, you wonder if it really is that easy to follow all the advice in it. Well, there's still some pages left. You start to save them for next time. Quitter! <laughs> No. No. Yo! Yo, Ryoga! Ryoga! Fuck! Ryoga! Oga! I hear that it's gonna be sunny for a while, starting this afternoon. What Looks a, like. Um... Hmm? Well, you know, later <laughs> in the day. Okay. Looks like we're not gonna have to worry about the fog for now. I guess Yukiko can just chill. The mm -hmm. fog always sets in around the morning after it's rained for a few days. Keep watching the forecast. Right. Counting on you, leader. I thought we agreed grand leader. What are you talking about? Supreme grand leader. So, this is lunchtime. Uh, sometimes during lunchtime, one of your social links might stop by and be like, Hey, you want to hang out later? Uh, you can tell them yes, you can tell them no, or sometimes uh, okay. it'll kind of just walk by like this. When they walk by, that means that they are ready to get to their next rank. It's kind of like a nice little hint to the players, like, hey, they're leveled up enough, and they're available today. And we actually will be hanging out with our sporty boys. So let's go do that. Because it is Thursday, so that would make sense. Yes. Not that we'll be doing it every day. Oh, hey, look, here they are. They were waiting for us. Oh, yes, it was. Uh-huh. Yo, Ryoga, going to practice? Since we have Sandman, we can. Oh! Yes. Oh. Okay. 
You also got me high field. You were thinking soccer practice. Pra practice? Your diligence is <laughs> Hey, Kwanji, turn on the goals and clean up before you leave, all right? Got it. <laughs> yep, got it. That raises our understanding. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Later. Hmm? What were those guys saying to you? You told Daisuke that you're going to tear down the goals and clean up. What? What? Everybody's supposed to take turns. You, you don't have to do that, man. Let's just go home. Hey. Hey, guys. Oh, the soccer team finished early today. What's wrong? You told Ko that you're going to tear down the goals and clean up. <sighs> oh, let me guess. They told you it was your job. How predictable. But yeah, you should probably do it anyway. You think so? How come? You got no right to dump it all on him. <coughs> Don't do it because they told you to. Do it because you want to help. That'll throw him off guard. Here, I'll help out too. It'll go faster. Mm. Alright, let's do it. The three of you clean up the field. Whew, I'm beat. That's because you got so into polishing those balls, man. You gotta pace yourself. No, it's not my style to have ass things. Damn it, dice game. Oh boy. So it went pretty fast with three people. Thanks for the help. Huh. No problem. Daisuke looks happy. With three music notes. <laughs> hey, you wanna grab some ramen on the way home? Clean up went quickly thanks to their help. You sense their consideration towards you. Aww. It's so kind of them. I thank you. <laughs> you decide to go to Aya. Ba 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 ba. Central Shopping Ooh. District, Chinese Diner, Aya. Hey, I saw the first year of your practice today, Daisuke. She was watching you the entire time, man. I even heard her say, wow, he kicked the ball so hard. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> duh, that's kind of the point of the game. Hmm. I didn't notice. Really? What a waste. <laughs> Enough of that crap, Ryoga. Want to stay after practice to work on your game a little more? Let's show these guys what you can do. Yeah, that's a good idea. If you can run circles around them, they'll have to accept you, right? <laughs> right? Exactly. Then it's decided. You don't get a say in it. <laughs> You're helping too, Coco. <sighs> what? Since when do I have to do anything with, for the soccer team? <laughs> the three of you discuss practice. Okay, let's put some fight into this. And we decided to go home. You know what happens when we go home, right? Welcome home. Nanako says welcome home. That's what happens when we go yes, home. Yes, absolutely. We're going to read more, I take it, right? Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, this book is the first book of what we'll be finishing. It is... Oh, that makes sense, yeah. It is a very important book for the beginning of the... Oh, hello. Hey, it's Yosuke. Do you want to go inside the TV tomorrow? I know you have other things to do, but think about exploring, too. So, every so often, the character is just like, Hey, you haven't gone to the TV world. Do, do you think we should? Do, do you think we should? We should go, right? It gets annoying. But we can tell them to fuck off. Mm-hmm. Oh, boy, oh, boy. We're continuing reading expert study methods. The book contains tips on how to concentrate, blah, 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 saying words. It's the same description each time. It's kind of, it's kind of annoying, but oh well. They have more important things to focus on, to be fair. 
<sighs> Morning, Ryoga. It rained yesterday, but there wasn't any sign of fog setting in. Looks like the weather will stay normal for at least a little while. Little while? Mm -hmm. Wait a while? Wait a uh, itty bitty bit, itty bit. Started getting a little bit of Elmer fudge there. So I don't think this rain will be a problem for us. Hey, you ever have nights where you're so nervous that you can't get to sleep? Yeah, absolutely. Haha, <laughs> you too? I'm glad to know I'm not the only one. Anyway, let's stay calm on our toes, right, leader? Yes, leader. Mm -hmm. Grand leader. Supreme leader Snoke. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yep, threw that one at you. Yeah, you did. Alright, what are we doing today? Well, it's gonna be a little more... Not these guys, because they're not available. Yosuke! It's been in the game, there's not much to do, so we're just building up Yosuke. Yo! Yo, Ryoga! You tired? Rushing things is gonna help us, blah blah blah. We've said this before. Let's spend okay. some time with Yosuke. Alright! Music! Woo! We're at the... Okina City, in front of Okina Station. We went somewhere else? <laughs> yes. Oh Yusuke my. brought you all the way here. Oh yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll be able to go here on our own eventually. Mm. It's been a while since I breathed this kind of air. You know, I'm just a poor little city boy drawn to that urban scent. Wait a minute. Am I starting to sound like Teddy? Oh no. Mm, you're looking hairier. <laughs> Don't you mention it. The phone with my facial soap this morning had... <laughs> hey, you're making me scare myself. But he's smiling. Well, that aside, what should we... Oh. Oh, text message. Ah, more spam. Looks like someone got my address. I get a lot of spam. You really like that ho the Hawaiian fake meat? Is that your thing, Yosuke? Oh. <laughs> this this com or this decision actually can be any of these. So, which one would you like? Yeah. Eh, what can you do? Hmm. Yeah, I know. I don't want to change addresses, so... Yosuke is signing. I haven't changed addresses since before we moved to Inaba. I mean, I might get a text from someone. It's hard to call, you know? If I call people just to let them know my number changed, they get annoyed. And some of them never plan to text me anyway. Oh, but hey! Don't look at me like I don't have any friends! Eh. Though, to tell you the truth, I don't remember what we all used to talk about. I can't really call them friends anymore, I guess. Inaba seems to be just fine. Plus, well, I got something I need to do here. <laughs> Counting on your partner. Partner? <laughs> He's country boy. <laughs> you can sense Yosuke's enthusiasm. I feel you understand Yosuke a bit more. Rank up. And now Yosuke can perform a follow-up attack during battle. When you knock on an enemy in battle, your ally will sometimes follow up. This is why it's important to also raise up your party over social links and not just immediately run into the dungeon. Right, These it's going to help a lot be better. Nice. Oh boy. Yeah. It's even better in uh, Persona 5 where all of your social links can, you, can give you abilities and not just your party members. <laughs> it becomes so important. Well... With that in mind, should we head back? It'd suck if something happened back there while we were over here. Alright, let's go home. Wait, let's get everyone a souvenir, but then go home. Alright, let's go. You return to Inaba with Yosuke in a hurry. Welcome home! Thanks, Nanako. Oh. Have you already finished that book? Yeah, 
All it's going right. to help us out in the long run. Heck yes. Yes, it will. Blah, blah, blah. Same, same text. But not only we finish the book, you feel as if your knowledge will increase faster with studying at your desk or in the library. Oh, my. Yep. You overhear students talking. Oh, my. Hey, did you hear? There's some part-time job listings on the town bulletin board now. Oh my. I wish there was one that would let me make some quick cash. Huh. They don't think you have the diligence to handle a job that takes a lot of time. Oh, that's so mean. Maybe I don't, but I, I bet I'll be more diligent if I get a job. I bet you wouldn't do too well the job where you want to work with others because you lack understanding, huh? I don't need to work since I'm focusing on my studies. If my grades are good, I might be able to swing a raise at my allowance. That's cheating. Oh, I wish I was born to a rich family so I didn't need to take a part-time job. Or if I knew someone nice enough to buy me anything I wanted. I don't think that would have been so great. There's someone like that at our school, too. Uh-huh. Oh! Hmm. What's her? I wonder who they were talking about. Oh no. Well then, I will begin my lecture on the Age of Discovery, which occurred between the 15th and 17th centuries. Many types of vegetation were introduced to Europe during this era. Among them, tulips from Turkey deserve special attention. Gardening for pleasure was becoming popular, causing the price of tulip bulbs to rise. It was the world's first economic bubble incident, Tulip Mania. Along with the South Sea Bubble and the Mississippi Company, it is said to be one of the biggest bubbles in European history. Hey, Mr. Hanamura, wake up! What was the first economic bubble incident in the world? Oh uh, no, uh, he uh, missed uh, it. What? What? Uh, help, Ryoga. What's this ergonomic bubble she's talking about? She just said it, wasn't it? Wait. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I thought it was Tulip. It was Tulip Mania, and I thought it was the first. But South Sea Bubble sounds like a thing, too, now. But I think Tulip was the first. Tulip was the first. Isn't that what she, isn't, yeah, that's what she just said? I was doubting myself. No. You gave him the answer you think is correct. Hmm. So you were actually listening. Yes. It was Tulip Mania. Tulip bulbs imported into Holland became extremely popular, and prices jumped dramatically as a result. At its highest, a single bulb was worth the price of a luxurious house. What? However, once the bubble burst, prices fell once again, and the trade cities in Holland were thrown into confusion. Mr. Hanamura, do take care to not let that snot bubble of yours burst, or you may also be thrown into confusion. My gosh! I'm not making snot bubbles. Anyway, I was right, wasn't I? But yeah, uh, thanks, Ryoga. I'll have to stay away for the next one. Look at that. Yosuke appreciates us. Yay. And our expression that... increased. Alright, so you recall hearing about a bulletin board with part time jobs in the shopping district. Maybe we should go look at those. Oh my. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and save those part-time jobs for next time, though. We're gonna go ahead and end the episode here, and uh, well, that'll be it, I guess. See you all mm -hmm. next time. Bye, everyone. Have a good one.